races save the difficult parts for the end. But with its twisty turns right off the bat, Cat Scratch Freeway breaks all the rules. Speaking of rules, we interviewed Birdie Backfire earlier, and she had several of her own. First, we had to sit in a booth. Then she needed warm milk every hour on the hour. Finally, she told us we could ask whatever questions we liked. But she would only respond with stories about her cats. Parker, we learned what these racers are about to find out. It's Birdie's way or the highway. All she has is her cats and winning. Now, she just has cats. I know this is difficult. She just needs time. I must have really hurt her feelings when I threw away the gift she gave me. But I didn't know it was a gift. Well, I can see why she's upset. That's mean. What am I supposed to do with a dead bird? Your girlfriend gave you a dead bird? No. Katarina, my cat, left a dead bird on my pillow. We've been talking about your cat? Yes. Why? Nothing. I know this is difficult. She just needs time. Hammer time! Seventeen! Seventeen! Watch out! That robot smashing really put me in the mood for another race. Me too. And I know a new and exciting place to do. No, no, no. We... What's wrong, Clutch? No. Mr. Then cover your eyes, Mr. Fiddles, because we can now fast travel to Hansboro. Open your world map. This is Hansboro. Heavy on the haunts. What? Finding your way there can be tricky because it's often nighttime. And when I say often, I mean always. So there it is. You're when you're ready to go to Hansboro, just fast travel to that garage. Ah, I mean, ah, Hansboro. If you like being creeped out, this is the place for you. I admit this place does kind of grow on you after a while, like a rash. But seriously, watch out for creatures that go bump in the night and during races. All terrifying jokes aside, the folks here are just like you and me. They love racing and, uh... Hey, look at that castle. I wonder what it costs to heat that place. Alrighty, there are three ra ra races here. Swampus, Spider Spout Hollows, and Flytrap. Which means it's time to get fancy. Very fancy, Vicky. These waterfront shanties cost more than just a couple bones. Oh, I see some race fans are already here, ready to take in the race from their swamp yachts. They better watch out for large alligators, as should the racers. If an alligator's mouth is open, do not, I repeat, do not go inside. Unless there's a power up in there. Then just try to be really fast. And that's what we call an ANN alligator safety tip. Now, back to the race. Go, go! Get it?
incoming communication from Clutch Tower. Ah, bad news, kid. I just got this thing in the mail. You ever heard of a foreclosure? Oh, dear. I certainly have. Yeah, me either. I thought, eh, foreclosure. It's probably something to keep my doors and windows shut, but, oh, 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 brother, it sure ain't. Turns out I'm a little behind on a few payments around here, and, well, uh, we're gonna get shut down if I don't come up with a pile of cash hey, ASAP. Oh. How? Oh. How? Oh. I'm begging your pardon, but what about the Sky Cup Grand Prix? Great idea, Tim Top. Winning that Sky Cup sure would turn things around here. Heck, it might even be the one and only chance to save this place. But no pressure. No, 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 Mr. Fiddles, get off the table! Bad dog! My oh, jambalaya! I'm just saying, as a journalist, I am also a singer. They should let you sing. It's added value. They pay me either way, but this is like getting a car and only driving with two wheels. Which is more like a motorcycle or half of a car. Exactly. You're leaving money on the table. <laughs>